Good morning everybody, this is Bernie from Tauranga Wellness Clinic and this September I am going to be doing a weekly, I think it's going to be weekly, um, short little videos about how you can detox naturally by changing up things um, either by using products in your home or by changing up things in your home. And why I've decided to go with detox this September, well, it's spring and a lot of people naturally start thinking of cleansing and just getting out there and just getting off a little bit of the um, excess that came with winter hibernation. But also there's a lot of talk out there um, about different things that have to do with detox. And as always in natural health, there are conflicting different schools of thought. So I'm not going to be going down that road. I'm rather going to be showing you some very easy things you can do from home, affordable ways that can make changes over the long term. And the first thing that I did was to actually change over my pantry. So for many, many years, and I'm talking about decades, I was the Tupperware queen and I had every single modular thing that coordinated, all my color lids were all the same, I freaked out when I had different lids and it looked immaculate, it looked so tidy and so amazing but then I wisened up to the fact that plastic actually wasn't good um, and the reason for that being that the plastic was had BPA in it and BPA is a known um, xenoestrogen so in case this sort of language is not known to you a xenoestrogen is an estrogen that mimics the actual estrogen production in your body and long term that can affect your hormones that can affect your um, neuroinflammation that can affect yeah just your general well-being so I was a little convicted by that and slowly but surely I changed my pantry over to glass. So first of all I did it for myself and for my health and for my family's health. My second driving force behind that was that it was actually good for the environment but that wasn't my main driver. Um, so I'm going to flick my camera around and just show you what I did. So bear with me. All right, I honestly don't know how to do this, so I'm just going to show you. So at the back here, I've got my glass bottles. And as you can see, I've got one here that says Brazil nuts. So what I have done is I have repurposed all my glass bottles from the supermarket as I have bought them to purchase items. And thankfully, most of the stuff that I purchase is actually on... Um, are in glass bottles and then once I've used it I wash it in the dishwasher and I actually use masking tape so there you can see I've got masking tape on the label and they go into my pantry and I organize them according to different groups I've got my rices I've got my lentils and pulses I've got some dried fruit, I've got um, nuts, I've got oats, and I've got my flowers, the, the different flowers that I use. And so that way I keep everything tidy, accessible, and I must admit I have also noticed since I have swapped over to glass that I don't get weevils. One of the things I also did was because I know when I went over to glass was I actually started purchasing my um, products from companies that sell them in bulk bins and I take my glass um, containers, empty glass containers to them. I get a discount here locally. I use bin in. There are maybe different places close by to where you are but I get a discount for bringing my own container and I have and that way I don't waste. My pantry is not cluttered with packets that go well past their due date by date. I don't have weevils anymore because of things that have gone old or um, have become a nesting ground for um, those little pantry moths. So 
yeah, all round it's a win-win. So I thought that inspire you to make a change. You don't have to go full on, biff everything out all at once. I did it slowly and um, little bit by little bit replaced everything that I had in plastic and put it into glass. So yeah, that's one way you can easily afford to detox at home. Alright, look out for my next videos as we're going to be looking at some other interesting things. Until next time, bye!